Tail types here, back to play some more house flipper. So I'm still in this horrible, horrible little shack as my office. Uh, we need to get out of here soon. But we are not doing that today. We are going to carry on with the jobs from the Luxury DLC. And we're going to be helping out lovely Lucia. Lucia. So a warehouse for memories. Let's jump over there and check this out. It's not exactly a house, I know. But I've heard you're a real miracle worker. I'm sure you will make this place habitable. Even if the last caretaker didn't make your job any easier. We like the roughness of the building though. This is supposed to be a grown-up living space after all. We've always liked hanging out with our friends. And since we're getting a bit too old <laughs> and tired for clubbing, we wanted to finally get an apartment big enough to sit around and enjoy our company comfortably. Probably you had more experience with couples getting a bigger home to start a family, but it definitely is not our case. Child-friendly is not something you need to worry about while designing this place. It looks like you've got a lot of work ahead, so I won't take any more of your time. <laughs> Have fun! A warehouse for memories. Cool, this one looks interesting. These are all so var like varied so far, which is what's super cool about them. Charles, we are proper like down to the town, down to the town town this time. Uh, we still can see Jimmy's yacht. Hello. Um, and then we've got, by the looks like we're on the river. Yeah, cool. So coming sort of just like emitting from somewhere by the looks of it. It's quite rough. There's quite a strong current in that river as well. So, yeah, I think this is the one. Is this one of the ones we saw? I think when we had the first preview trailer, we had this one. Garage doors, I have to say I'm never a massive fan of these, but I'm hoping maybe you can get rid of that. Let's have a quick look. Looks like you can actually get rid of that. That's cool. So in the in a proper renovation you can get rid of that. So we've got it's pretty small. We've got this downstairs area. All big open plan living. Up this kind of spiral staircase. Oh, this is not super practical, is it? Uh so we've got little kind of bathroom what is going on there what is that uh, and then like a mezzanine area with some barrels <laughs> okay oh and then there's like a little that's cool there's like a little veranda section interesting looking house over there i feel like that's one of the ones we're going to do that looks familiar right so let's get to let's get to cleaning this place up uh, and then I will bring you back when we've got to uh, got to kind of a blank canvas. Right, I think there's one cheeky little section just up there. See that little corner? Now the game is probably going to want me to use the scaffolding to do this, but let's just have a little look. Just for funsies, can we make it? Uh... Is there any way we can like parkour over there? Hang on. <laughs> I do these little things. Sometimes I like set myself little challenges to see if I can do this. So let's jump over there. Jump onto that railing maybe? Oh, can I not jump onto that railing? Let's try this one more time. <laughs> I will not be defeated. Yes. Oh, okay. One more, one more go. We can definitely make it. We can definitely make it. I'm sure we can do this. Get over there. Oh, this might not work. I was just thinking this might not actually work anyway. Because I've got to get, I've got to get to, uh, kind of far. Let's see. I think once I get to there, hmm, I'm a bit screwed. Let's have a little look. Oh, there's a beam in my face. I don't think you, yeah, you can't jump from, you can't jump from squatting down. Oh, these beams aren't actually real. Sweet. Okay, let's do this. We're going to jump off the edge here and then make it over there like Spider-Man. It's going to be like Spider-Man. <laughs> oh, okay. We'll get the scaffolding. <laughs> we'll get the scaffolding. 
Okay, right, so that's the last, I think that's the last bit of mess. Uh, interesting about this as well, notice that we're outside with the mop. Uh, it does say we're in the garden up there, and it's green on the HUD, but yeah, we're outside with the mop and no hose, which is interesting. So, one last little thing that was kind of interesting about this that I noticed is what are you supposed to do with these? Are these just trash? Oh. I was hoping maybe they were a thing. <laughs> I was hoping they were maybe a thing you can do. Uh, this looks massively unsupported. I guess it's supposed to be like it's concrete cantilever or something. So let's do this start off the with the stairs. So grab the, the cell object thing. Uh, and we'll do Well maybe the maybe the wood. Quite like this the steel though. And then maybe we'll go with a light. Yeah, that's kind of funky. Okay, so lay floor, herringbone, dark walnut floor, parquet. So that is this one. Does that presumably that's just kind of everywhere? I would assume. Oh, actually, there's a separate rooms. Yeah, because there's lintels there, so that's actually a separate room. So it might have been wrong. Let's do that. Have a quick look. Uh. No, it looks like it's the same. So in these bays as well, maybe? It doesn't tell me I have to do that, but it kind of looks better, doesn't it? I think we're actually going to go with white wood. We're going to go super clean. I think it's quite nice to have like a real contrast when you've got kind of industrial and then like kind of mucky old looking bricks to go completely the opposite direction and make everything look proper clean. So we're going to stay with white wood. Uh, I'm just going to kind of plop the furniture out and see what we've got so then we can arrange it. So we've got one corner sofa. Uh, let's go, I'm not a big fan of this sofa but we'll go with that and we'll maybe go, these patterns are not, not, are not nice, <laughs> they're not nice. They're too kind of flowery, they're not modern enough. That one's not too bad, I guess. I guess you have got the option just to not have them. But then that looks silly because they're not like suspended against anything, right? So you've got to have, you've got to have those because otherwise they're not sitting on anything. You cannot have the second ones, I guess. So let's go. I am just trying to make it. Yeah, I guess that's okay. Not the colours I would have chosen for that at all, but. So we've got, God, oh, that's huge. That is massive. <laughs> that is so huge. Oh God, that is terrible. It's so, like the proportions are so wrong. Look how high it is. Look how high the, 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 the seat is. Is there a table or like a chair or something? So this will, this will kind of make sense because it's a, yeah, this is supposed, this is, this is just wrong. That's like a, that looks to me like a, I mean, I guess these all look like they're big. Everything's big, isn't it? In this, I guess they've, I've, I guess what they've done is they've kind of made the furniture to kind of fit the spaces, but. That just looks so crazy huge. It, I think it's actually, as I said, I think it's the, if you think about where my, I mean, it's never easy to tell because you're always sort of in the wrong position. But if you think that light switch, again, light switch kind of maybe like chest height, I guess. And then, so if I was, I wouldn't be able to touch the floor. If I was sitting on there, my feet wouldn't touch the floor. That's what it kind of looks like. Maybe it's not right, but that's what it kind of looks like. That all the cushions are oversized or something, but it just it feels kind of huge. This is a separate room, isn't it? So this is going to be a fun, <laughs> it's going to be a fun one to try and lay out. Let's see what we can do. And we've got a fireplace to fit in as well. Okay, let's 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 whip that out. I guess that's where the fireplace is going. Fireplace. 
And then I think everything else is just kind of decorative. I guess that has to go there. Does that switch on? Yeah. Huh. Strange set of furniture that we've got for this. So how do you make this look good? Um, I mean, I guess it can just kind of go there, maybe. Everything's going to have to just kind of float in the space, which is fine, which is, you know, would, would be a thing in a a large space just to have kind of things, you know, massively off of the wall. Like in a small house, obviously, you make sure that's kind of like closed in and things, but this sort of thing, it doesn't matter too much. And you actually, you're trying to make things, trying to make the house not feel quite so sort of cavernous, I guess. Can't, can I not get rid of that? That's annoying okay so and then the tv maybe goes over the fire like so oh they've changed it cool that's kind of jazzy that's pretty cool um and then we've got more of these more of these living wall things, as I said, someone someone's decided this is this is what luxury looks like. <laughs> these things define luxury. Um I guess we'll put one there. I don't really want to put one next to the T V and the fire, because I know it's a bit weird. Maybe back here. Then we just move that table away somewhat okay right I've jumped ahead a little bit so I did take a little, little bit of a liberty hopefully this is not going to stretch my budget too far but I decided to sort of separate this section off uh, so just put this rug down put these couple of units in and this little bit of decoration obviously usually I'd kind of decorate all these shelves but as soon as it's just the job I think we'll leave it just felt like it helped break up the space you know it creates this kind of little hallway um and also i tried switching around the sofa the other direction but you just kind of ended up with yeah not really feeling like it worked um i've also gone ahead and like decorated and tiled everywhere that kind of needed to be tiled so we can just kind of do the arranging um so we're going to do the we'll do the kitchen next i think so i pulled everything out of the workshop Oh, sorry, out of the out of the store. Um, so we've just got to try and kind of work out how this is going to get arranged. I think it's probably, I think it's going to probably run along that wall. I guess there's no cooker hood, so it's a bit difficult to tell exactly where everything's supposed to be going. But let's try this. I kept it all in the the base colours actually, the straight out of the store because it looked like they actually quite worked quite well quite cool to have a bit of a contrast in here as well um there's a couple of little things i don't know if these are intentional things but um so this this cupboard color for example is the black gloss and you cannot get that i think is a dishwasher yeah you can't get the the dishwasher to actually be in the right color which is kind of annoying um and then we seem to have like a superfluous unit I guess this could go, I guess this could go there. Oh, well, maybe it's supposed to go, this is supposed to go next. Well, that's cool. Yeah, it's like a little bit for your, your condiments and things. And then this goes there. And I chose this kind of bright colored uh, fridge. Just thought it might funk it up a bit. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Nothing too exciting. And then we've got a clock going on in here. Again, I think this would be really cool as one to do um you know actually when we do the big house when we do the proper renovation can we get a big clock in here yeah yeah maybe we'll go up there so yeah that looks all right not too bad so far all right let's crack on to the next one so this is one that's got actually a little inspiration thing so notice they're not saying anything the last guy 
It seemed like it said something. This is now not telling me anything. Uh, finally, I can have a separate room to take and edit my pictures. I need a well-lit spot for nice backdrop and computer desk, that's for sure. Create a cohesive aesthetic here. Right then. So, oh, we have got a choice. Looks like we've got a choice to make. Did we have this before? Are we choosing? Oh, I don't think we are choosing. We're just seeing some mood boards, basically. Cool. I still can't quite get my head around what the point of that is. Oh, those are those are cool, aren't they? I like these. Because it then goes ahead and just sort of tells you what you're supposed to use anyway. I know I've said that a few times because it's a broken record, I'm sure. But let's clock that in. Um, we've got a bunch of things we're supposed to be doing. Uh, right, okay. I guess so. These things. Mirrors. Mirrored. I don't know if you'd really want. Let's get let's get the let's get the kind of bones done first. So there's a big door here going where the garage door came out. Okay, and then we've got the doors to separate these little rooms off. So one of them is like a storeroom, I think, and then one is a bathroom. Is that right? Open right. Yeah, so that's like a storeroom, I guess. And then this is actually a, a, like a WC. So let's do that again. I'm trying to remember what I did there. So I've kept the frame and the details in whatever the base color was of that. So that, 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 and then that. Oh, I've done those the wrong way around, don't I? And so that's the bathroom one. It's a little trick for how you get a door out that you've placed down already. Just give it a whack with a hammer. <laughs> if you doubt, give it a whack with a hammer. There you go. You get it back out again. Um, okay, so now we can maybe do this. Quite sure what we're supposed to be doing with these, but let's. So, so there can be a mirror. Let's go with mirrored, I guess. Just to. Bounce the light around. If we only want one of those, it seems like we only want one. And then I guess so. Let's pick the yellow. Oh god. I I'm I'm still not kind hundred percent actually those quite that that one's quite cool. I'm not hundred percent convinced that this is that these sort of bubble things really make a lot of sense maybe they make a difference to how it works or something so we'll pick the we'll pick the yellow maybe it work makes a difference to how the the costs are calculated or something or the bonus the bonus or something i don't know let's just plop those down for now and then we'll come back and rejig it Just the one of those? I don't really know. Uh, some plants. It's always difficult with these to tell because you're like, until you've put everything in, you don't really know how much space you've got. Um, good vibes only. Strange selection of things to use. Let's put that, let's maybe put that in. And then this is another piece of art. Okay, that's quite. That's actually quite nice. Can we go XL? Yeah, that's quite funky. Might have to rejig that slightly, but that's quite funky. Uh, and then this one. This is a photography studio. I quite like that. Quite like that one as well. XXL. It's a bit much, isn't it? Let's not maybe go with XXL. Well, 
I'll kind of just do that there. I'm just going to kind of put, again, I'm going to put everything out and then we'll see how much space we've got to play with. I'm trying to keep these episodes relatively short, but <laughs> I think I'm going to be struggling. Um, so tasks, so light switch. So I've, I've, I've put a bunch of places. I've sort of sorted the light out and stuff like that already. Uh, a dresser. Interesting. I guess that could go next to this thing. So there's a desk. Right, I guess so. So it's sort of sort of coming together and then the key there's a, a poof is that supposed to go with that quite sure guess so and then we've got a computer set up yeah that's kind of cute that's that's all right so that will go over there keyboard Kind of cute little setup. Yeah, it's not really make doesn't really make sense for a studio, but because you wouldn't want this just you know big light like that, I guess maybe. Um, yeah. Okay. Cool. That's that one. So we've done that. We've done the kitchen upstairs. So upstairs so far, I've just painted this the these bits of the. Uh, I think that was biscuit or something so this is supposed to be a bedroom so Havana bed again I'm just going to keep everything really simple because I think the I think the brick texture kind of does so much adds so much kind of detail I'm just that's not terrible this is a this is a big old bed. This is a big old bed. Ooh, okay, maybe like there. And then we've got oh, that's actually quite nice like that. Ooh, I actually quite like that. What was that? Was that just yeah? And then but can we change the handles? Yeah, nicer. Light and white. Quite just sure why the the white ones are. Actually, lighter than the light ones, but never mind. So two of those, quite chunky again. This stuff. Two of these. Are these small? Oh, they are quite small. Okay, so those can sit. One up there. One up there. Cute. Um, pictures. Oh, we've got a big one of these as well. Kind of just sit in the corner, I guess. And then a bunch of pictures. We'll stay with a. We'll stay with the black frames. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Quite liking this so far. Uh, maybe we'll go with the larger ones here. See what the larger ones are like. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Like it. Like it. Like it. No wardrobe space, but hey ho. Um, next one. So then we've got this bathroom tiled out. Of this bathroom looks like this is going to be pretty simple. So we have got one of these. Let's stay with that kind of rustic style now we've done that. New assembly. Cool. Um, so it's got a sink, another sink. Oh, we've already done that. Shower plumbing system, so it's got a shower and a toilet in it as well by the looks of it. So let's put, um, maybe put the shower here.
Yep. And then actual shower. I've probably put that in the wrong place. We had this before. Maybe the door will open the wrong way. We shall see. No, nope. that's okay. That's all right. Oh, no, that's not. Crap. <laughs> so annoying. You can never quite tell. So it's got a specific place it wants it to go, which is... You can never quite tell. So it has to go that. It has to go in that corner because of the way around that shower door works. Cool, which kind of means that the... So the door opens like that. So I guess that means the toilet needs to be over here. I guess it could be there. Um, suspended toilet plumbing system. Yeah, I think we'll do that. i not sure why this... Maybe there's supposed to be two sinks in here? Let's see. This might be... This might not be right. Oh, no, there is supposed to be two sinks. Okay, cool. So it was that one, wasn't it? Cool. Uh, and then we've got the toilet. Why is that? Yeah. Maybe we'll do, maybe we'll do something. I don't think this is going to look great, but we'll do it anyway. Yeah, it looks all right. Um, we're getting close to budget. We're getting close to over our budget. Hopefully we'll be okay. Right, this could just stay all nice and clean and white. Um, couple of lights. Switch those on. And then we've got two mirrors, two round mirrors, which is a bit of a shame. White wood. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, that's... My budget's fine, don't worry. Don't worry, Lucia, we've not spent all your money. You're all good. Right, so that's that one done. Okay, so last room, right, I think, hallway kind of thing. Oh, we've got hallway. Yeah, that's all kind of part of the same dealie. Right, so we have got um, that one, bathroom. So we did white, 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 and white. Uh, we want the door open in that way. Yes. And then we want the bedroom door open in the other way. White, 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 and white. Cool. So that opens that way. Uh, and then we've got an, oh we've got another we've got another sofa. Interesting. So this is another little kind of hangout spot. Right, so let's try and again just get all of this stuff out um, and see what it looks like. It looks like it might be a bit of a squish up here, but we shall see. So we've got one of these as well. Uh, we've got another coffee table. We've got a little set of drawers. So this little set of drawers could actually go over here as well, couldn't it? Uh, what's that? Oh, it's like a gym thing. Interesting. Then we've got some lights. Yeah, we've got another exercise bike. Let's do that for now, and then we can, as I said, we can always rejig it. All right, okay, and that's basically it. Then plants and decoration. Interesting, interesting. 
that can go up there. So this is like a little, it's like a little snug, I guess. One of these doors opens, doesn't it? Do these all open? Oh, they do. Okay, cool. And then we've got another set of lights up here. So these probably should go. Oh, God, I thought I'd fallen off. I thought I'd fallen to my death then for a second. She said the health and safety is not a well, child friendly, didn't she? She said it's not an issue. Cool. Uh, and then a couple of flowers and plants and things. One of these puppies. Uh, let's go with a, a blue pot. Why not? And let's put these. God, they'd, they'd love these, don't they? Go to town with these. <laughs> Go to town. Have a million of these everywhere. Oh, God. Okay. Um, can we put these? Uh, there's nowhere we can put these kind of over there, is there? We've just got to have them everywhere then. We've just got to kind of have them everywhere. I guess there can be some over here. So two more and one of them. Last one. Yeah, last one. Let's change that to different color flowers I guess that'll have to go there then I suppose let's get that one up in alignment with it yeah cool right and then we've got stuff to do out here as well so nothing to do out here we're missing something somewhere something is not done so that's done that's done Oh, there is a top balcony as well, isn't there? Out here. Is there something we're supposed to do out here? No, that's all done. What am I missing then? Somewhere I'm missing something. Oh, these little little bathrooms, that's it. Okay, so that's all done. And then we've got... Oh, this is like a fitted wardrobe space. I just stay in the dark, actually. Dark colour might be kind of cool in here. This is gonna be this is gonna be squeezed in. So this is I presume it's supposed to be like a dressing room for this studio sort of thing. Which is kinda of, kinda of cool, kinda of nice little idea. It's always cool to see like them doing new oh it's gotta go the other way. Just new little thoughts is really cool, just not like just like a house. It's got some other concept behind it, which is always kind of fun. They've done a really good job with these. Uh, the, the sort of characters behind these. I think they've done a really good job on. For me, you let me know what you guys think in, in the comments below. Right, so that's that one done. And then last bit is this little... So what have we got to get in here? We've got to get a... Yeah, so as I thought, it's just a little WC. So sink here... here. Uh, cool. Like that new little sink. Great for little tiny. Oh, gold. Great for little tiny spaces. I'm sure she won't mind a bit of water on the floor. That's all good. <laughs> oh, we'll have to clean that up, won't we? Because it won't let me finish it. Yep. Toilet. Uh, suspended toilet system, so that can go there. The old suspended toilet again, just stay in the white. And then one of those, keep it small. 
like those actually, they're cool. Yeah, I wasn't sure about them initially, but I think they're cool. Um, yeah, maybe just like a grey towel. Cool, jobs are good. Done, 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 done. Alright, let's complete this one, see how much we get for it. Hopefully get some decent money this time. That's better. 21,000. Yes, please, we definitely want to complete the job. Thank you very much for watching, peeps. My name is Toves. Do not forget to like and subscribe. And as I said, we'll be streaming this. I'm streaming this weekly. Uh, this week it's Thursday if you're watching this uh, at the time that it comes out. And um, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next one. Take it easy.